Okay, we're gonna do more of an undead nightmare type scenario. So let's get into it doing a circle here. I might put some damage. What damage will the skull have? You see the skull very prominently in zombies. Drawing these initial lines to kind of get the feel of what I'm doing. I'm going to start filling in kind of the darks here immediately. I'm going to start with all the darks. This is a different way of drawing. I'm going to start filling in the vast majority of, of dark shapes. First. Using the side of my pencil for almost all of this. Get some damage there, and his brain is exposed, possibly. It's looking too happy. I don't want him to look totally happy. All right, so I got all the dark shapes uh, right now. And I'm going to go in. Uh, let me see. Let me show my pencil. going here. I might pull out with my eraser some light shape in his eye, like maybe he's got a demon spirit in there or something. I'm trying to think of the story a little bit too, even though I mean these aren't like, illust like illustration, full-blown illustration stories, but you, know, you kind of might want to have a little bit of storytelling in everything you do. Like, how did this creature get like this? How did this person get like this? And then I'm going to go along the edges over here and Tracing the uh, nasal passage up top. Remember the nose, which the nose is essentially just a triangle, the nasal cavity over here.
Went through a lot of things. Put in, um, see the open brain over here. It's kind of cracked a little bit. Uh, some of the jaws aren't as even as they should be. Sometimes I, I did that. I kind of did that on purpose, so I'm not gonna lie. This and this are not even, but that is an accident. I fixed that. Putting in the little, almost like a ray of light. Like I said, uh, thinking about how this particular got zombie got damaged. Maybe the way that he did a zombie or a skull or a mutant or whatever. But at this point, uh, I would try to like unify a lot of these little shapes that I put over here. I put a lot of tiny little like nicks and scratches and folds. And a lot of that is going to be trying to unify them through how dark they are. You know what I mean? See, I want them to kind of connect over here. I want them to be close in value, but not obviously not the same because this is a much darker value in here. All right, that's about it for this demo. Thanks a lot, guys, for watching. I appreciate it. Subscribe, uh, maybe share with your friends on Facebook. And uh, yeah, thanks a lot, guys.